What's up guys, my name is Brandon, you guys can call me Swifters, and welcome back to a brand new Fortnite video here on my channel. Today I am coming at you guys with a super exciting video because in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at 5 new things coming to Fortnite. In today's video, we are going to be taking a much closer look at a ton of things that are both confirmed by Epic Games to be coming to the game, alongside some additional things that were leaked in the game files, regardless with all of the things that we will be going over throughout the rest of today's video, we can expect to see them coming to Fortnite over these next couple of days and possibly weeks. Now before we truly do get started with today's video, I wanted to go ahead and remind all of you guys that if you do plan on purchasing any skins in the item shop over these next couple of days, to make sure that you guys use my supporter creator code SWIFTERS. Go ahead and plug that code in, and if you guys do so happen to use my code, make sure that you guys take a picture of it and tweet it to me over on Twitter. The link to my Twitter can be found in the description below. If you guys do so happen to send me a picture, I'll be sure to go ahead and drop both a heart and a retweet on your guys' photos. So shout out to all of you guys who have already used my code. In addition to that, I wanted to go ahead and remind you guys that this code does expire every two weeks, so make sure that every 14 days you guys re-put my code into the item shop. With all of that being said, let's go ahead and get started with today's video taking a look at five new things coming to Fortnite. Alrighty guys, so to go ahead and get started with today's video, the very first new thing that we may see coming to Fortnite is something that was recently leaked in the game files. This is the brand new machine pistol. Now according to new assets discovered in Fortnite's volume 7.10 patch update, these files actually indicate that the machine pistol weapon may be coming from Save the World into Fortnite Battle Royale. Now the machine pistol is an automatic pistol weapon that has been present in Fortnite's PvE Save the World mode for quite some time, however these new assets indicate that it may also appear in Fortnite's player vs player battle royale mode extremely soon. On top of that, the machine pistol closely resembles an Uzi or a mini Uzi, which is also a small, lightweight submachine gun. It's quite likely that the machine pistol will be placed in the submachine gun class in Fortnite battle royale. So as you guys can see on screen right now, this is what was actually found in the Fortnite Battle Royale game files and clearly this is a 3D rendered image of that brand new automatic pistol or that brand new machine pistol. Now the description for this particular pistol is, sprays bullets at an extreme rate, dealing, punishing damage, quick to reload and good for running combat, but ammo hungry and ineffective beyond close range. Now, just sort of seeing this pistol in the game files alongside reading the description of it, I can't help but sort of connect that to the Taxa machine gun, and for those of you who have been playing Fortnite for a pretty long time, you guys definitely remember when the tactical submachine gun was added into the game. Unfortunately, for some reason, Epic Games decided to remove it from Fortnite Battle Royale, and they vaulted it. However, just the other day in the classic or the vaulted limited time mode, the Taxa machine gun alongside some additional items that have recently been vaulted were actually made available for all of us to use specific in that LTM but of course as I said this brand new automatic pistol kind of reminds me of the Taxa machine gun so even though the Taxa machine gun may not actually be coming back to Fortnite Battle Royale it looks like this brand new machine pistol or this automatic pistol may sort of function the exact same way so I know a lot of people really missed the TAC submachine gun, as did I, but it's extremely possible that this brand new mini Uzi type weapon may pretty much be the exact same thing, aside from the fact that it may just look a little bit different. Regardless, I am so excited to see when in fact Epic Games does decide to officially add this brand new weapon into the game. So moving on to the next new thing that we may see coming to Fortnite extremely soon, this is actually another thing that was leaked into the game files, here we have the boombox. So it appears that this is a brand new consumable item found in the Fortnite Battle Royale game files and multiple assets have actually been discovered suggesting that this brand new boombox is going to be a brand new item and potentially a new consumable added into Fortnite. Now it's super interesting because in the game files we actually have both audio and visual files added to those files and I'll go ahead and show you guys exactly what those images look like and I'll go ahead and play the audio in just a second but before I truly do that I wanted to go ahead and say that right now we unfortunately don't have any description for this boombox nor do we really have any background information about how exactly it's going to function however a lot of people are actually under the impression that this boombox may function extremely similar to that of the boogie bomb whether or not this is going to be another throwable item or maybe it's going to have some sort of other role in a fortnite battle royale again 
We really don't have too much information about this new boombox, but it does look like it's going to be a brand new item or potentially some sort of consumable added in to a Fortnite Battle Royale extremely soon. So of course, let me go ahead and show you guys both the audio and the video of the new boombox. So you guys definitely get the idea of this boombox and as I said while we unfortunately don't have any background information or even a description for this new item it definitely seems super super awesome and I cannot wait to see what Epic Games decides to do with this boombox but of course moving on to the next new thing coming to Fortnite this is another thing that was leaked in the game files but here we have a carrot that's right guys you heard me correctly a carrot Leaked in the game files, it actually looks like there's going to be another consumable item added in to Fortnite being the carrot. Now a lot of people are under the assumption that the carrot is going to function very similar to that of the apple or the mushroom. As you guys know, apples and mushrooms are the two only consumable items that are in Fortnite that are found on the ground or that we have to scavenge for aside from just the regular loot. As you guys know, a couple of months ago, apples were added into the game and when your character consumed them, they were granted 5 additional health points and then shortly after, mushrooms were added into the game and when your character consumed those, you were granted 5 additional shield. So according to the game files, it actually looks like the carrot may function very similar to that of the apple and the mushroom. Now unfortunately, as of now, we don't necessarily know what sort of perks this carrot is going to grant our character once we consume it. It's very possible that instead of just granting health points and shield, the carrot may grant both. 10 shield and 10 health. At the same time, it's also very possible that we may get an increased speed boost. Maybe if you consume a carrot, you're able to run quicker for a shorter duration of time. But of course, we're just gonna have to go ahead and wait and see exactly what this brand new carrot consumable item actually does when it's added into the game. Continuing on to the next new thing coming to Fortnite, this is actually another thing that was leaked in the game files. Here we have a brand new mysterious egg. Now, let me go ahead and give you guys a little bit of background information about how this egg is going to be so significant, and it's actually very possible that this egg will have a pretty substantial role in our overall storyline. Now, I'm sure there is a ton of you guys watching this video right now that may be super familiar with the HBO series Game of Thrones. If you guys have not seen that show, I highly recommend checking it out. Now, I'm not going to give away any spoilers, but the Ice King in Fortnite Battle Royale, which is obviously the tier 100 skin of the Season 7 Battle Pass, and the Night King, who's one of the antagonists in the Game of Thrones series, definitely have some similarities. Combine that with the overall idea that winter is coming, and of course if you guys have seen a Game of Thrones, you guys know winter is coming is a huge saying, and of course we come to Season 7 here in Fortnite, there is snow everywhere, we've got the Ice King, there's a couple of coincidences suggesting that we have dragons potentially coming to Fortnite. Again, I'm not really going to spoil anything, but I think you guys can make sort of the deductions and the inferences that if we have dragons potentially coming to Fortnite Battle Royale with these eggs, you guys could sort of see where they may have got their inspiration from Game of Thrones. So of course, in the game files, it actually does look like we have these very mysterious eggs popping up around different locations so I'm super excited to see what sort of direction Epic Games decides to go in with these new eggs. Will the dragons have any significance to our overall Fortnite storyline? I guess we're gonna have to go ahead and wait and see exactly what happens as we progress throughout Season 7. So moving on to the fifth and final new thing coming to Fortnite. This is in regard to a brand new in-game special event. Here we have the Fortnite New Year's Eve event. Now, as you guys know, in the past, we've actually had a couple of really awesome in-game events. This included the rocket launch, and not too long ago, we actually had Risky Reels flattened by the block. And of course, these were all things that occurred in Fortnite real time across the entire world for everyone to experience in their own home. But of course, it actually does look like we're gonna be getting a brand new New Year's Eve event here in Fortnite. This is going to include a disco ball, some fireworks, and a ton of uh, super awesome things that we may actually see coming to Fortnite live in-game all at the same time across the entire world. 
So guys, there you have it. Those were five new things coming to Fortnite. Let me know your thoughts, opinions, and your feedback regarding all of those things in the comment section below. Regardless, guys, that is going to be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to drop a like down below. Subscribe if you're new. With all of that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll be sure to catch you guys later.